Hello everyone, my name is Pat Ferrara and I work with Westminster Consulting spearheading their Human Capital Advisory Services. Happy New Year and thank you for taking a few minutes to watch this video. You know, in 2021, Westminster expects that HR teams and, and HR executives will continue to be challenged and will continue to have opportunities that were completely unexpected two years ago. Uh, we expect that there will be five areas that HR teams and HR executives will need to focus on. It's not an exclusive list. There are going to be many other challenges, many, many other initiatives, many other projects, things that you can't even anticipate right now. But we believe that these five will be consistent across our, all organizations, and they're very much interrelated. Uh, the first and foremost, and no surprise to anyone, will be a continued emphasis on diversity, equity, and inclusion, especially as we begin to implement and embed the changes into our policies, our procedures, our cultures, when we continue to walk the talk, because we know that our employees will be watching. So we think that's going to be probably the major focus for 2021. Uh, a second focus is a return to the spotlight and to center stage of the strategic thought leadership of HR, uh, HR leaders. 2020, of course, HR did take front, front stage and center stage, but it was more operationally. We needed to get things done. We needed to continue to hire people and terminate people and onboard people and, and get them into plans and, and, and manage the day-to-day -day from kitchen tables. Uh, and we did that. But 2021 now will give us the opportunity to return to thought leadership around things like diversity and equity and inclusion and around things like talent management, reimagining how we are going to learn from a distance, teach from a distance, manage from a distance. We also expect that 2021 will continue to emphasize the importance of our employees' mental health and wellness with, a, with an important subset, we believe, on, and, and focus on financial health and education. If anything presented itself so boldly in 2020, it was that we, we saw that Americans across the board were woefully unprepared financially for what went on last year. Um, financial education, financial wellness, financial health, very much related to mental stress. So we believe that'll be a focus as well in 2021. So please take some time to look at the material that we sent. Also, please take some time to look at the complimentary services that we're offering in 2021 in the human capital space. We hope to hear from you. We're here to help. Please let us know how we can be of assistance to you. Thank you again for taking the time to watch this video and please have a great, happy new year.